Hey guys, so um, today is going to be a short video because I don't have much time, but I'm going to be showing you really a downfall of these transformers. Very cheap. You probably have like a bajillion of them lying around. This one says output DC of 9 volts at 650 milliamps um, of maximum current, right? Takes the AC input voltage. Now it says 9 volts, right? So you would expect, uh, you know, LM7809 or LM317 configured for 9 volts, right? You know, you'd expect some sort of regulator. But, well, let's see if they put in a regulator in this thing or not. I'm gonna, I'm gonna plug it in to the wall. We're just gonna take the multimeter and you're gonna see it's center positive. I'm sorry if this thing renders red badly. Touch that. 13.87 volts. It's almost 14 volts. That's nowhere near the 9 it says. Look, I'm not kidding. It says it says right there, 9 volts DC. Well, we should check and see if it's actually DC or not. That is DC. Very nice. Clean DC signal. If we set it for DC, we're obviously going to have to go 5 volts per division. But you can see it jumps up there. Right when I touch it. jumps up but oh so it is it's DC it's um is DC all right see I have it on here and there's low ripple at least but it's not regulated at all that's terrible you don't so you don't ever want to trust those kind of power supplies you don't you don't want to trust them at all because their output voltage is never what they say it is it's always like six volts higher it can be terrible in some cases so just a warning out there, make sure you check with your multimeter the um, voltage of your power supply before you plug it in.